you can break a four into two twos and you can take those twos and split them into two ones but the ones however well they're not divisible by anything make this good if we just take the pieces of glass and we'll place them back onto the top of that card all we have to do is just give it a little wipe and then the Queen restores and she is no longer smashed find a spectator selected card. So we're going to leave the nine of hearts in the middle of the deck and to find it all we're going to do is, hang on a minute, <laughs> what's just happened there? Don't tell me that you've chosen the only broken card in the deck, the nine of hearts. Well that is interesting. We can fix this. If we take the pieces we're just going to leave them in my hand and I'll just close my hand. Actually, I'll tell you what, to make it even fairer, you hold your hand out and you hold onto the pieces. So really squeeze those pieces and just imagine that they are gonna disappear and then return and restore your selected card. Here's a mixture of card and coin magic. We're gonna use a coin to find your card in an interesting way. So we'll start off, we'll leave the coin inside the box and we'll just put that to the side for a moment. Select a card, so any card, there you go, the five of hearts. We'll leave that in the middle of the deck. What we're gonna do is make the coin vanish from the box with a snap. So you can hear it leaves the box and it actually sinks into the deck. Now it sinks into the deck and it stops at one particular card. What was your card? Five of hearts. Lastly, the King of Diamonds, and they don't just turn over, you can see they change into the four aces. So we'll take a couple of cards, we'll take the Queen and the Four, and we'll leave those back to back and we'll put those in the spectator's hand. We'll just give a little click, and you can see the two cards merge and become one. We can get it apart with just 
just a little flick. You see the two cards set 